those peoples, let's talk February favorites. I um, had a wonderful February. Of course, it was my birthday month and it was Valentine's Day and it was just wonderful. So, I have somewhat of some new favorites. There goes my friend. Uh, somewhat of some new favorites to show you guys. Zoe! Oh, she got down. So let's get started. I have a variety of things. I guess we're gonna, let's start with hair stuff first. So as you can see, I have my hair um, straightened and in bantu knots. Well, I've been a bantu knot out or whatever. So um, one thing that's been helping me not get, be so frizzy and so crazy has been the Curl Care by Dr. Miracle's Frizz Control Serum with vitamins and fights through humidity and frizz. Um, it says it's supposed to help hold curls for up to 12 hours. Uh, I wouldn't say that, I wouldn't go that far, but this does do well at keeping my uh, hair from getting like extremely frizzy. Um, I haven't used it on like my natural hair texture because I really originally bought it just to control frizz and to keep shine with my hair and it has been doing a wonderful job. When I do my Bantu knots, I just put this on and it does great. It, it makes my hair really shiny and look really nice and so I have really been liking that. Um, an older product, hair product, is the Talia Wajid Protective Mist Body Fire. This is supposed to moisturize conditions, soften, detangles, all that kind of stuff. This is great. It does well at detangling my hair, at um, making it really, really soft and manageable. It Everything that it claims to do, it is amazing and it does. So I suggest going out and get this. This is maybe like six or seven dollars and I get Talia Waji products from um, Sally's. I've been loving my Sephora Primal Instincts palette. And this palette is just great for just traveling and taking with you because it has like the matte black and the matte brown but then it also has like the really pretty shimmery pinks and purples um it only has one other matte shade and that's the shade at the end and it's like a matte like white beige color so that'd be great for your highlight i don't use it as a highlight but you could so you've all seen my uh vanity palette the beautiful wonderful amazing lovely any other great adjective you want to put in there you've seen this palette before and so um, it's no surprise that it's a favorite of mine but I've been using it a different way I've actually been using the matte brown which I usually use for my crease I've been using it for my brows I take an angled brush and I just um, just fill in my brows with that and it just makes a really softer look. I really like how it makes my brows look a lot better. And it's just a great color for my brows and it just makes them look softer and more put together and more natural and realistic. So yeah, I've been using that in a different way. And the last actual makeup product is a blush that I've been liking a lot and it's by NYX. And I actually did not think I would like this blush because it is like a brownie color. This is Coco. And it's like a really, it's like a reddish brown color, but this just gives the most beautiful flush to your cheeks. It's like if you want to do like the no makeup makeup look and you want and you're like my skin tone and you just want like a nice flush to your cheeks, this is really, really pretty. It reminds me of the La Femme blush in Sienna. It's just a great, um, just a reddish brown type color and it's just great for women of darker skin tones that want some kind of color but don't want to be like really, really bright. This is really great. So for nails, I have been loving orange nails this month. For some reason, I don't know why. I guess I'm trying to get into the spring and summertime and I want really brighter nails. But um, I'm actually wearing one right now and this is Essie's Tarte Deco. And this is just a really, this is more of a corally type orange but I just think it's so, so pretty and it's so bright and such a nice pastel -y color for like springtime. I'm really ready for warmer weather and springtime you guys. Like I'm just trying to bring it in. So I try to brighten my spirits <laughs> for the fact that it's not here with bright nail polish and this is definitely one that I've been loving. So moving on to body stuff. Keeping with trying to bring spring and summer here. I've been loving my Forever Sunshine body triple body cream triple moisture body cream and body spray. The body spray is somewhere and I do not know where it is so we're not going to go for that but I do have the triple moisture body cream. First of all this this 
texture of the triple moisture body cream is amazing like it's really thick and moisturizing but it doesn't get like really sticky and it like sinks into your skin really nicely and it's not sticky at all so I really like these this is my first time ever trying like this type of lotion from Bath and Body Works but um this says that it is a blend of golden apricot pink peonies and a hint of praline and this just smells like Oh, it just smells like spring and summertime. It just smells like really tropical and really floral. Oh, it just smells really good. So this has been something that I've been loving to wear as of late. I have one skincare product and you saw this in my Target haul. I think I bought this at Target, but this is the Bior Pore Unclogging Scrub. And oh my God, the first time I used this, I just, was amazed my pores look so much smaller my skin just looks so much more radiant and I've never had that happen with like a lot of the cleansers I've used and I think the difference is because this cleanser is like a a cream cleanser I don't really um, use cream cleansers I use more like gel based cleansers and stuff like that um, and I don't know why but this is just so freaking amazing I love it so much um, I feel like it does smooth my skin and it really does deep clean my pores and I'm I had to get used to the consistency of it because like I said I'm not used to cream cream cleansers but um, yeah, I really like it. It does have little beads in it, but it's not really over exfoliating. So you can use this every day and not feel like your skin is being over exfoliated. So um, yeah, I, I highly suggest that you pick this up because it's really, really nice. So I have kind of a fashion favorite, which I really rarely ever have because I always forget or whatever, but I wear these boots all the time. Like, mm. 85% of the time if I'm going out somewhere and it actually matches my outfit I'm wearing these boots and I'm talking about my studded um, riding boots that I got from Charlotte Roos the only thing I hate do I have them backwards yes wait the only thing I hate is that the some of the studs come off like you can see like some of the studs are missing like it's missing right there or whatever um, of course no one's paying that much attention except me and they also have studs on the back which some have come off like you can see that one has come off or whatever but I just think these are amazing I love the buckle I love the red detail in the back um, I like the, the little wooden looking heel I've been looking for some nice riding boots for the longest they have a buckle detail up here as well and these are just really really nice they're really really comfortable and I don't know I just oh I love these so much I just been looking for some riding boots and I saw these when they were on sale and I'm just so glad I got them and I wear them so freaking much it's ridiculous and then I have an app <laughs> and it's actually called a uh, quiz up I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it wait till it comes up it's called quiz up and this is just my favorite app ever in life Okay, so this is basically a quiz trivia type app, and um, it you like my favorite topics. I'm gonna do a close up, but my favorite topics, like some of them are snacks, 1990s TV, Disney. You can like do trivia on different like brand logos. They have um, Breaking Bad. They have all of the TV shows. They have like Vampire Diaries, Breaking Bad. Um, Disney, Gossip Girl, Twilight, like all of these, Glee, Eminem, Friends, I love Friends, um, just all Big Bang Theory, all different kind of topics that you would want, that you could do trivia on and you just do trivia and you get points and stuff and you can play with your Facebook friends. My name on here is Pretty Pisces 88 the same as my YouTube name, so if you want to find me, then you can find me, download it, and we can play together. Um, I just love this game, but if you don't like like pop culture stuff, they also have like literature, they have like uh, medical terms, all different kinds of stuff like that. I've learned so much medical terms um, from, this, from this app, so yeah, I really like this app a lot, and I play it a lot. I should play it as much as I do, but... I really like it and last but not least I'm going to talk to you about two people that I love I'm not gonna do people every time because I may not have people every month but I do have two people this month 
First is Brittany. I mentioned her in a couple videos before. Her name on here is Belle Belle Bella and I will link her down below. I just love her personality and her spirit. Just watching her videos is just a joy. I don't know because I just like her personality. She's always so perky and so upbeat and she just always does great videos she just does great reviews she has like these three minute reviews that she does and I just love her videos so much so I will link her down below she recently uh, got 1,000 subscribers so yay and uh, hopefully I can send you some more Britney so I will have her channel down below another girl is Sam I think her name on here now is Samantha Jane um, I'm pretty sure that's her name but anyway I will link it down below she's my Canadian friend I feel like I mentioned her before I could have but if I haven't I'm just gonna go ahead and mention her now because she's freaking awesome she does like these oily skin diaries which is something I really love because we are both all slick girls and we you know we connect on that level and um, she does these oily skin diaries so she tests out different foundations and I just really feel like I can relate to her in certain products if she suggests a product I definitely feel like I can use it um I don't know I just trust her input and I love her videos she has the cutest cats or maybe she has one cat I don't know they kind of look alike but anyway <laughs> I will link her video down below so that's my favorite you guys I hope you enjoyed it let me know what your favorites are down below and um that way I can see if there's some new stuff that I need to pick up in the stores and I still have some money left from birthday gift cards and thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.